All right, this is at the Melicon in Chapala, and this is the day after the wall fell down by the Chapala sign. And I'm on the other side of the Melicon, looking east, and you can see how this wall has some bulges in it, and it actually leans, if you look closely, in places like right down in there. Okay, we're gonna head now back to where it was, and I'm gonna show you cracks in the sidewalk uh, in along the edge of the wall in several places. I'm doing this kind of offhand. I'm not using my uh, holder for my phone uh, to do this one. I just decided not to because my voice will be a lot higher. And uh, this section right in here all looks pretty good. And I'm going to be showing the ground in this one. As you get up here a little bit further, it starts to change. Starting right up here where this white uh, part is, this semicircle. Now see it starts to dip right here. And then there's a crack. There's a crack all the way along here. And it seems to stop, but this seems to be redone. And there's a crack going across right there. And there's another crack right here. And this has dropped down. And I'm going to go out over the edge. Uh, right here, this wall is actually leaning a little bit. Okay, now we're going to continue. And see, there's that crack there, and that's dropped down at least two inches and look at that crack going in right there yeah. and it's all along here this is probably 75 to 100 feet all along and there's grass growing in here now see here it's pretty pretty wide that's at least two inches wide and there's a crack going out to there and you see it's cracked along the wall at the very bottom here where they've got you know posts and stuff and then this this crack over here that they fill part of it in and there's a crack going across here that's opened up and another one there and there's several if you look out through there okay this crack keeps on going and there's another crack beside it and here's a place here where it's settled and that might have been for compact from compaction that they didn't do a good job on me. But this is all going into the lake. And there's some here. And then there's a couple of places here where it's opened up over the years. And this is where they load the boats to go to Scorpion Island. And people getting ready to go to the island. There's a guy fishing, there's a fish, fishing pole. He's got it somehow hooked on to there. Got a couple of poles. People getting ready. And as you can see over there, they're working on uh, where the wall fell down. Now, this is part of the Melicone wall that fell down yesterday, sometime in the early morning hours. And I did a video on this yesterday, and this is the work they've done uh, just yesterday. They started working on it. And this section right in here, I'd say, it has to come out. It's on this side, right here, where the sea is on the Chapala side. There you go. I'll zoom out and let you see it a little bit more. wall goes all the way down around there and zigzags but they're digging it out so they can put a foot in they'll bring concrete trucks over somewhere here but it's set on on uh, some of the stuff on other channels it has said that uh, it's real dangerous they're glad the beer garden didn't fall in well it's nowhere near the beer garden there's 175 feet between the beer garden and it but there are cracks over here 
as you can see I'll zoom in right here you can see the cracks right there see and this section right here is I'd say it's just leaning out just a little bit now the section over your on the other side there looks pretty good but there is some lean in it in a couple of places but it looks pretty good and the Chapala sign has been undermined on the further end of it but I don't think it's going to fall in like a lot of people have said but this section right here could go and this is a section they're they're really worried about so we'll see what happens but see there's a lot of room I'll zoom back out but see there's a lot of room between the Chapala sign and the beer god restaurant and that's around towards the town people sell things underneath these big beautiful trees there's two beautiful trees right here I mean they are big. okay that's all I'm going to do for this video uh, this is kind of an update. I won't do videos every day on this, like on the construction. Unless something happens big, then I will add to it. But probably next Monday, I will probably do a, another video on on the how they're doing on the wall here. Thank you very much for watching my YouTube videos and subscribing to them. And tell your friends about it. I have over 300, and I want to thank the 300 people over 300 people that have subscribed to my channel because i really appreciate it i started this as a fun thing to show a few friends and here i am doing it every day thank you very much bye now